Hi guys, it's Prissy with Prissy's Divine Design Tarot and today we are doing a love reading for Hajiquin. Um, but I do, before I start, I do want to make a little message here, uh, announcement, um, that I won't be putting the uh, K-pop boys bands and the K-pop girl bands together in a love reading um, or any readings. Uh, I'm keeping them separate because I had um, been informed that there's a lot of scandal and hate and bullying and I'm not about that. I am about the love and the light and about spirituality and getting people <coughs> to open to the idea, <coughs> excuse me, of God. So, <coughs> excuse me. <laughs> In any case, um, just so you understand what I'm saying, um, so if I was to do a reading for uh, Hajiquin, okay, I wouldn't put him with the love reading with Black Pink Lisa or any of the other girl bands, okay? I'm not going to be doing that anymore. Um, I can still do the request, but they will be, Hajiquin will be Hajiquin plus um, future spouse, love reading. Okay, so that is that's the extent of that I'm gonna do. So just so everybody's aware that that is changing on my channel. Okay, so um, just because I don't want my channel to be associated with anything uh, that might hurt somebody or be upsetting for people, um, because there is a bit of a culture di difference here. Okay, so um, please keep. By all means, um, keep up the requests and I will get to them as much as quickly as I can. I have done um, a few today. I'm going to take a bit of a breather after this and then I'll do a few more tonight and uh, put them up as quickly as I can to get them in for you guys to see. So let's get started with Hajiquin. Hajiquin. I think that's how you say it. Love reading. And his future spouse. Alright. Spirit, please let me see clearly. Messages I need to see. Oh, looks like somebody from the past is maybe getting some karma. Ooh, let's see. Oh, in love too. Okay, there's, there's justice here. I think those were further down. Yes, so we had some five of swords, so some gossiping or stabbing in the back or picking up all the swords so they can't be used against them. Hurting people. But it looks like there was some healing here with the four of swords. And then we have the Six of Cups. So this has to do with the past, being hurt in the past when it comes to love. And there is justice in the heart of the reading. Let's see. What else, Spirit? But there's been healing from that. So, yeah. Could have been um, who Hajikwan maybe saw as wish fulfillment or the future spouse thought as much or they could be a star as well an idol or somebody in the k-pop uh, atmosphere and there's some news here when it comes to the ten of pentacles wow okay Let's see, what else? I need one more card, please, Spirit. One more card. Alright, thank you. Yeah. Had to do with uh, some shady ass behavior. So, looks like for Hajukwan to get his Ten of Pentacles, 
there was some karma either he's going through or the person that wronged him is going through somebody didn't want him to get his ten of pentacles someone from his past wanted to hold him back it looks like oh what's on the bottom of the deck temperance angel so this could have been an earth angel that did this or Hajukwan is an earth angel. Let's get the energy for this. For Hajukwan and the future spouse. Alright, so let's see what comes up. My candle went out. Alright, so we have material harvest and then we have disruption for, and that just seems like they're blocking them, you know, from trying to get this ten of pentacles, okay, or hold them back from it, and this is material harvest, so it looks like Hajukwan has been guided, and it looks like he did the work, and listen to spirit or whatever form he believes in and did a transformation he did his work that he was supposed to and that is why he is getting the ten of pentacles but it looks like maybe this person from the past that did this in the past that tried to hold him back or speak badly about him, they might be coming back, back around. So let's see. Let us do, hmm, yep, more of the bad talking with the Five of Swords again. So let's see, what's the Five of Swords, please, Spirit? Let's clarify the Five of Swords. Hmm. It might have been when he was single. Or they were waiting for him to be single. What's the Four of Swords? Thank you. Yeah, they wanted to hold him back from his money and his long, to hold him back long term. Because he was at the Nine of Pentacles already. He just needed one more pentacle to get the Ten of Pentacles. And these are seeds, seeds he planted a little while back that are now starting to come into fruition <clears throat> after he did his healing. What's the Six of Cups? Ten of Cups. I feel like this person was trying to deceive them by being somebody like a shapeshifter. Becoming what Pajikwan was looking for in a person. And they put on a mask and became what Pajikwan wanted them to look like. So that they would think that they are wish fulfillment or they're happily ever after when it comes to love and I feel like it was a choice here I think he saw through the mask yeah there was an offer and maybe even an offer of marriage thinking that this person was his happily ever after the justice or swords and justice is here for the truth and balancing the scales he did the work he did the healing You might need to rest up because something big might be coming <clears throat> for this person. Oh yeah. <laughs> With the uh, Wheel of Fortune and an apology. Yeah, somebody's coming back around to 
Hajiquan the star, as if their wish fulfillment. To try to get his ten of pentacles. They must know his destiny. They must know what he's meant to do. What's the page of wands? Yeah, they just want to, uh, conflict, chaos, competition. Yeah, there's news of this. That maybe that's what they were going to do. He might have seen that. Yeah. Wow. Oh. No love there. I don't know if you can see that. The cup is upside down. We have um, a new passionate beginning. Marriage card, maybe. Moving in. The temperance angel being patient. And then no love in the cup. So this is... This is pretend this is somebody that has a mask on they they have a mask on and they're pretending to be something they're not yeah yeah an offer of love but they don't yeah crossroads yeah five of cups and death yeah no, he saw this. What's the Ten of Pentacles? What is that about, please, Spirit? Yeah, some confusion about what his destiny was, what he was meant to have. What's the Seven of Swords? Why is that here? To do with the future. Should I stay? Should I go? trying to get him to not really know which way or which direction to head. Could even be two options here. Yeah, he knows what to do. <laughs> he sees this. Yeah, the Six of Swords. He's going to calmer waters. He knows what he needs to do. What's the unspoken truth here when it comes to this? Yeah, with the disruption here, and it has to do with the material harvest that he's supposed to get. I know I crossed the line with you. I bury myself and work to forget you. Just being near you is intoxicating, so they're jealous. They're jealous. I hide behind material things. We both know I am not the one for you. Yeah, jealousy here. I left when I saw you with someone. So, they're not being authentic. I lost myself for a little while. Yeah, they're not, they're kind of toxic, actually. And I think he saw right through that. Let's see, what does the romance angels need to say here? Or Now this is a soulmate. Now that we all have soulmates. Some come in. Um, there's like twelve different types of soulmates that we can have. Okay. Some are here for a little while to teach us lessons, and then they leave our life. And then others are here for a long period of time, which could be family. Some are good. Some aren't so much. So, I mean, it all depends on what kind of soulmate you encounter and what they're meant to teach you along the way. Yeah, they wanted to, uh, yeah, I kind of feel like this is a soulmate. They wanted to marry him with the wedding card there, okay? And it says, you deserve love, you're lovable. And there was no love here. The cup was upside down. So 
so it was just a facade. Yeah, they wanted him to be attracted to this person. But I feel like it was to hold him back from getting his ton of pentacles. His material harvest. Can I get two more? One more, please, sir? One more? Love yourself first. Absolutely. And that is how you become a ma magnetically more attractive. Whoa. Unrequited love. See? I'm not going to take those. Although, it was chemistry here and for giving and learning because that is God's way forgiving you take it up with God you um, you let go right you give it to God and then you work through your emotions and then it's up to God they, they'll either get karma for what they did to you or they will learn other lessons that are meant to learn Heart-to-heart -heart conversations, honesty here. Honestly discuss your feelings with each other. And in the end, we saw him walking away. It's unrequited love. And he has bossed up to being an emperor. Now, this person that was trying to swindle him here is having sleepless nights and might have a lot of anxiety and regret and for doing this because now they're going to have karma and justice was in the middle of this reading so that tells me that this person yeah they're not going to have a lot of strength they're going to be stuck in their head for juggling this person or trying to um fool them by making it look like it was something it wasn't. Yeah. So, I totally feel like this person was putting on a facade, uh, a mask, um, pretending to be something they weren't. They weren't being authentic. And... God wants you to be authentic. Spirit wants you to be authentic. They don't want you to be wearing masks. They don't want you to... They want truth. He wants truth. I mean, look up John 4, 24. It's about worshipping Him in spirit and truth. So, if you're not being true to yourself, how can you be true to anyone else? And the biggest crime to ever have, the biggest upset, is when you don't believe in your own self. And you can't be authentic. So, yeah. Anyhow, I'm going to leave it there. Um, whoever this person is, uh, it's not going to work out. Whoever comes into his life next that's trying to make him miss out on his opportunities with his ten of pentacles they're either there to take his money or to make sure he doesn't get the money and hold them back so anyhow we'll let oh well please like share and subscribe and um what else did i want to say i said my announcement earlier i think that was it all right, guys. We'll see you next time. <laughs> Later.